Hello, my name is Kim Sauer at Apex 2015. I'm joined today by Pat O'Brien from ITW. Now, ITW, Pat, is um, something that maybe not everybody will recognize immediately. Um, so wh wh what's behind it? Uh, so, uh, I agree. Uh, the ITW brand is certainly one that's prevalent in the marketplace, but most people in this industry are more familiar with our product brands, the uh, Speedline MPM and Camelot products, and Vitronic Soltech, mm -hmm. Electrovert, mm -hmm. um, all of which have been ITW companies for a long time. And this is the first show where we're really bringing uh, all of those product brands into an ITW booth. So products, brands remain very viable, mm -hmm. but uh, we are now starting to consolidate uh, some of our back office functionality in these companies into a common ITW entity. Okay, and that obviously reflects on, on well, it, it gives your customers a lot of benefits by, by doing that. It does, we think it does. It, um, you know, what we are able to do is build some scale. Yeah. And so, particularly in back office functions that are, uh, you know, it certainly will not negatively impact the customer experience. Mm -hmm. We're able to share uh, efficiency, share best practice, mm -hmm. and uh, even to the point where we'll start to share some of our manufacturing facilities, which we hope will build flexibility, better lead times, things that are really important to customers mm -hmm. in the long term. Absolutely, and I guess also that, that um, you know, knowledge and experience that all those companies have combined together makes it very strong as well. It does. Um, so our plan is not to integrate our channel, integrate our product, product roadmaps, but we will have a small center of excellence where we have some of our very talented engineers mm -hmm. uh, that can share some of the fundamental building blocks across our product line. So we do think that long term we will benefit in the product mm -hmm. development area from that. Mm -hmm. and let's talk about uh, not product development yet, but the, the, the products that you do have and what you're showing here at the booth. Are there any individual you know, launches or, or new additions? Well, we've, I, we've got quite a few, and I don't know that I want to go into the individual <laughs> products yeah. themselves, but uh, one of the benefits of, uh, of bringing the companies together is we have taken some of what we have reclaimed in efficiency and put that right back into R&D. Mm -hmm. So across the line between our soldering solutions, our printers and dispensers, um, you know, we're showing lots of new features and functionalities here at the show. Mm -hmm. Um, and really excited for the you know the people that have been by shows great mm. and uh, we've had lots of interest. Excellent. Now you you also well you're a global brand but we're very much focused here at Apex on, on the Americas. What do you see as trends, challenges for this particular marketplace? Well I think you know I guess I feel like the buzz at the show has been pretty positive. Um, I think you know for the most part people are coming off a very positive 2014 mm. and uh, you know as we we come into 2015 it seems like uh, you know the, the mood is very favorable right so, so. Um, certainly there's this market where we've always had uh, you know a lot of cyclical challenges but it seems like uh, with a, with a strong economy particularly in the mm. Americas mm. we're uh, we're going to be heading for a good 2015 and that's sort of the the, the feedback I've been hearing which yeah. is very encouraging also the show floor if you look around you know is, is, is very busy. Um, so just finally, although we're only halfway through the show, you, you have sort of touched on it, but um, what have been the sort of, uh, what's been the feedback about that ITW integration from customers? Uh, so in some respects, it's been almost a non-event. Um, okay. Yeah, yeah, and it's been positive. I think people yeah. resonate and understand uh, the, the message and the, the, the reasons behind why we're bringing them together. Uh, but it's, uh, I don't think it's been any mystery that these companies have all been owned by ITW. Mm. So um, I think people are wondering uh, how far integration will go. There's obviously some fierce brand loyalty in the marketplace. Uh, and we think we're bringing together the parts that, will, uh, that are important to provide us for uh, that back office efficiency while leaving the independence of the brands to uh, develop the, product, the products in the uh, mm. In the ways that the, the customers that are served by those brands have come to uh, enjoy. Excellent. Well, very positive news. I'm going to send you back to your busy stand. Thank you very much, Pat, for Thank you. taking the time out to come to talk to us. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks.